Hello fiction fans, T.H. Leatherman here. Today we're going to review Opposable by Kirk E. Hammond. The stories are coming to life. As an unpublished author, he's known that his stories have been a little out there. But super intelligent cyborg cats, badass alien girls, and zombie creating brain parasites are what's in his head, or other people's heads, or whatever. Like any writer, he's driven to put it down on paper. But now, the stories are leaving the page and invading his life. His cat tried to kill him, and aliens of every stripe want his body, and not in a good way. In fact, everyone wants a piece of him, and he has no idea why. At least he can count on Zeno, his genius chemist brother. Zeno's not the black sheep of the family, he's the stoned one. It'll take a cross-country trip to figure it out. Sex, drugs, and insanity follow him like stink on a skunk. He'll need to figure it out fast. In less than three days, the Earth will be destroyed unless he can puzzle out the psychedelic trip his life has become. Nothing around him is what it seems, and everyone has an agenda. Will the author figure it out in time, or will he become a casualty of his own unconscious? He knows that the voices in his head aren't real, but they have some pretty great ideas. This book reminds me of the 1981 version of the heavy metal movie. Kirk Hammond starts off odd and just keeps getting weirder. Yet, it draws you into the story and keeps you there with mounting tension. Vividly portrayed characters, out of this world drug trips, betrayal, and a ticking clock will keep you turning the pages till the very end. Two things were a bit too trippy. First, the main character doesn't get a name until the very end of the book. A little odd. Second, the first chapter is so chaotic that it's hard to follow what's going on. After that, things take shape, and it's easier to follow the surreal world that the main character lives in. Four out of five stars. Thanks for watching and subscribe to my channel. If you enjoyed this episode, like or comment below. So long, fiction fans!